Police chase golf cart? What did you just say? It's simply gonna be out of the no. Can they do a spike strip? Maybe, I'm not sure uh, what that could possibly do to the car, especially with it being as small What? As it is. <laughs> yeah, uh, 19. Of, uh, is this a, this is a video game, right? Police chase, police in pursuit of golf cart, 19 miles per hour. Fullerton, Fullerton, Fulton? Where is this? Burbank. I don't see how that would ever be possible at the speeds uh, that he's going at. But uh, again, this is a uh, stolen golf cart, stolen from a security guard who was trying to call police uh, to get uh, the man's dog help, really, because uh, that man was threatening to hurt the dog. Uh, and uh, again, uh, I believe at this point, uh, they think that he's the rightful owner of this pet. But again, uh, a police pursuit here of a possible stolen golf cart making its way here through the San Fernando. I don't see any police. As we look live at the situation, we saw at least five. Oh, I see some lights. Lights right yes. behind uh, this golf cart with with the man just going through intersections here. He's just running and, red uh, lights and shit, huh? Speeds just around 20 miles per hour. <laughs> we were looking up speeds. 20 uh, miles per hour. hour. That's Imagine max speed. 35 miles an hour if they're street legal, but. Typically, they average anywhere from 14 to 20 miles an hour, which is consistent with what we've been seeing in that if this is electric, it can go anywhere from 15 to just 25 miles. Do we have any idea how far this has now gotten since it started, Eliana? Since it started, Jonathan, I put it at a good 10 miles or so. Uh, oh, shit. He's going to need another Florida, golf cart. We now find ourselves over here on full He needs uh, a swap. Crosser, just going to widen out here for just a moment so I can get that nearest uh, intersection. It's going to be Fulton and Oxnard as he comes up to the green light. Oh, uh, what the hell? These are officers. Who are those cops? Those are cops. They couldn't put a spike strip in front of a golf. You could have just walked up to it and stopped it with your arm. You're not going anywhere. Hold it. Like, what the fuck? The biggest clowns on earth, dude. You just walk up to it, man. You know, a spike strip that they would have the upper hand here, given yeah. how fast this thing can't go, typically. Uh, you would think they'd have the upper hand here, but it is the LAPD, after all. So they're going to need to really crunch some numbers to figure out how to solve this one. Oh, you want to link? My bad. If you're just tuning in, I'm watching a car chase. Police are after a a uh, golf cart it's topping out at 20 miles per hour if it's downhill fortunately of course they do have headlights and tail lights but even then they're pretty dim and uh, at the speeds that he's traveling at and running uh, red lights it would be difficult for a driver to you think the guy's drunk or something running that red light or running a stop sign so that's really the big concern I'm also especially of course concerned for that dog who is uh, of course innocent in all of this and every the dog's the brains of the operation dude on, that's uh, what he wants you to think the golf cart is being pursued He's holding the human the hostage. As five Drive. Of the LAPD. So you see them there. Damn, look, look at all those cops. cops. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, all the cops are in and stuff that you can steal City Hall. One golf cart, the whole fucking county. What the hell? It's be a stolen golf cart with that man there with a dog on his lap there. Ileana, tell us how this what? transpired again. Did, is, it, is it believed that he stole this golf cart from a security guard? Where was this that this took place? Well, Michelle, you know, uh, I know that you're a dog lover. I am oh as well. Oh, boy. So whenever I hear anything dog Stick to the facts, touch. Yeah. And so what I heard was that this man had this dog, we believe he owns it, and he approached the security guard and he had essentially... No, it's not Florida, it's L.A. ...food that he was going to hurt the dog. So, of course, at that point, the security guard called police, and uh, during that time, it's unclear how that transpired, but the man was able to get in the golf cart and take off. 
and that was in the area of Ventura Boulevard and Yolanda. He then made his way over towards the Sepulveda Basin area. By then, police were behind him. He wasn't difficult to catch up with, of course. Uh, so officers from the LAPD's <laughs> West Valley Division were behind him. They got the I wonder if he's overhead. drunk. And this has been going on now for a that is so slow. You can go faster than that on a bicycle, can't you? This really isn't that bad. He's all the way now uh, in the North Hollywood area. You can go faster than that on a bicycle, easily. It appears to be what shirtless and easily as well so there are cops in cars <laughs> behind him you can just ride up to him on him i could and i'm fat man i need to get a bike dude i'm gonna buy another bike that shit's really fun except i never wear helmets that's the only downside because they're for pussies they're magic and of course, uh, that's the problem that dog, but man i love bicycles maybe i should get a bicycle that, that and you gotta yeah. wonder like uh, did you he's gotta know that there, there's at least seven patrol units behind him maybe not that but a chopper and and also a chopper yeah, you know, yeah and, and, and i bring strip. that up eliana the fact that he's you know shoeless that he's not going to get very far even when this cart comes to you know to an end either on he's down to eight miles per hour uh oh you think he's running out of juice he's slowing down oh no down a bit here though he's continuing on and three now you said it's the north i think the the miles per hour calculator is stoned the shit just went up to 44 the thing is stoned they're trying to frame him oh he's speeding in a school zone either side of the road and this road he's getting framed so uh, normally I would say, oh, now's a perfect time for a pit, but that's not gonna Perfect happen. time for a pit? You can pit this guy standing up. You just grab him. And surrender to a Get over here. Again, uh, this is a man who was uh, initially making threats, uh, threatening to hurt that dog that he has in his lap, and then, of course, he stole the golf cart. And threatening to hurt a dog? Because the want here is an assault with a deadly weapon. It's unclear if the cart was used as a weapon potentially at some point or if you had... <laughs> that's the weapon? weapon? At a certain point when... The cart? Stole or allegedly stole this I guess that's deadly. Here. Yeah. Uh, Thank you. Eliana, talk about your day in terms of... You, you Let's talk about your day. <laughs> you really had two unusual chases. Come here you often? You earlier to one all the way out in Riverside County that was a big rig. That's unusual enough. And now to be covering quite the opposite. Oh yeah, we missed a big rig. On a straight. We couldn't be on more opposite ends of the spectrum. Uh, earlier today, as we were mentioning, we picked up a pursuit uh, that made its way all the way towards the Palm Springs area, and that was a big rig. Uh, and that pursuit lasted uh -oh. for hours. Nearly He's making a move. Hours. Is that a driveway? That He's getting some food. Where is he going? He's in a like a shopping center. So he's just on the other side of this building. I'll wind out the shot just to touch. No, what the hell? Here. Yeah, through the well, parking he's trying line. to avoid the officer on the corner. It looked like who had yet another spike strip. Oh my the god, the cops are so sharp. Oh, they're blocking. Oh, they're blocking. It's it's a blocking technique. Yeah, he might be boxed in. He is he boxed? Uh oh, he's he, he, he oh boy. The cops on the other side of the alley, are they going to box him? Oh my god, the cops are scrubs. There he is, and he got away. Oh wait! Oh, this is clown music time! Play the clown music! Whoa! Those are people! Those are civilians! Dude, what if... Oh shit. Uh, that's true, he, and he can easily drive on the sidewalk uh, much more easier than any of these squad cars possibly could, but they're not giving him much in the way of room. Uh, well, so I wonder why they didn't stop him. him. And uh, this, of course, just helps uh, other motorists. If you want the link, it's right here. That this is a pursuit too fast, that, too furious. Happen, you're just driving down the road on a Sunday night, and here comes a golf cart. You're scratching your Only head. Only in Cleveland show. And that, that's when you realize, oh, this is, this is a pursuit. LAPD uh, so are clowns. It's not even, like, like news. This, this a very Do you realize that every depiction of uh, cops damage, in any kind of entertainment right, has always been a fucking joke? Road, uh, it's not him. new. Well, I thought he was really going to get it's old news. There, and he was able to Wig him, dude. Get out. That Bring was me back one of them gyros. He's, he's what, what, what street is this again? As he goes underneath that underpass right there. It probably it's has to do yeah. so with who becomes cops. 
right? Probably people who go to the military and they do their time in the military and then they, I don't know. I'm not sure. Thank you. As he continues here along Victory on surface streets in the North Hollywood area, this chase beginning <laughs> and going on Thank a little you. over 20 minutes now, beginning in the Van Nuys area. Police believe this was a stolen cart. Uh, we know the man uh, has a dog sitting on his lap. He is shirtless and shoeless at this is point. Is the dog and shirtless? Very far once this cart comes to an end. Yeah. He's been traveling a little bit slower, though, than we've uh -oh. seen. Uh-oh. wonder, is he finally either 11 out? miles per hour now. Gas. Nice. Um, at this point, we're just speculating. Is that electric? It doesn't have gas. Do those things have gas? I don't think so. They don't usually make them anymore in, like, you know, combustible. I would assume it's electric. assault with a deadly weapon, this suspect here, as he makes his way slowly the valley there you did better math than i did I said, I was oh another parking lot that's high risk how slow this vehicle is you see he's trying to avoid the cops and he did another spike strip there might have been he had just avoided the spike strip again this is a fucking able to get ahead of clown show but it's baffling a little bit baffling baffling is the right word my man you use the right word baffling these these types of situations they are very expensive. This is hella expensive. Like deploying helicopters, police, all this shit going on right now. It's extremely expensive. And this is a fucking joke. You could stop it with your hand. Hold it right there. Just grab the, one of those bars. Grab it. And that'll bring things to hopefully a peaceful end. But for now, uh, we're now in North Hollywood, uh, just off of Laurel Canyon and Irwin. Yeah, we were looking it up earlier. Top speeds typically average oh, between 15 and 20 miles an hour. Top the speed. range on some of these can really only 15 to 25 miles. And I, I think you said last check, Eliana, it was about 10 miles already. We've certainly a little bit longer than that. Uh, you know, we could be halfway. And that, that's assuming it was a He looks pretty, either like he's chilling. <laughs> Uh, Just chilling with this dog, going for a drive. Area. The good news is, Eliana, this is a Sunday night, definitely the quietest night out on the streets. Uh, wonder what he's week, thinking. And, um, there hasn't really been a lot of traffic that we've seen. Ooh, but we did that see that close. officer. Wow. That was a close this could be a tactic, Eliana, where they're just trying to get directly ahead of him. Or yeah, at least they, warn the viewer. I mean, the driver's up ahead. Did he drive yeah, past that him? very well could be the case. He might be go that officer might be going ahead uh -oh. to block the road. So, but there, there he is. I was uh, thinking maybe we wouldn't see him pop out. I thought maybe that officer was going to block uh, the golf cart in under the freeway. But uh, that was, uh, again, the 170 freeway one more time. Shoot out his tires? You can't time, do that. Uh, on Canyon at Oxnard. The cops know that everyone knows that they're morons. That's why they're extra careful not to accidentally kill people. And that the more careful they are, the more they accidentally kill people. This guy was reaching for his coffee, and then the camera went on him, and he was like, oh. <laughs> Whoops. He was reaching for his coffee. Why, you can't drink coffee on camera? Oh! He's at a sushi shop! Oh, it's going down! They got him pinned in! Guns drawn! Multiple police officers, doors wide open! He's holding the dog hostage! He's running with the dog! He's holding the dog hostage, dude! Okay. Did he do something to the dog? Oh, there's a dog. I think the dog got away. Hey, the dog's all right. He's trying to get in there too. Piss on him a little bit. A hundred cops to catch one fucking asshole armed with a dog. <laughs> One of the officers taking the dog. Hundred thousand dollars of taxpayer money. This guy was armed. He was driving top speed in a golf cart and armed with a dog. This is one for the books for both Susie and I, who have covered many pursuits here on KCAL News. Extended magazine. They arrested the dog. <laughs> Get down. Get down on the ground, you motherfucker. You're a suspect.
Oh! What was that that replay? Damn, that was sick. Hey, that was pretty hype, dude. Nice, thanks for letting me know. The police are chasing a guy on a golf cart in LA. Breaking fucking news. Better go let Harris know quick. Look at this guy. <laughs> this just in. Hot off the presses, dude. <laughs> we already fucking watched it. It ended. It turned out that the white guy with no shirt on was the hostage and the dog was the kidnapper. <laughs>